this is the right way. You excuse me, excuse me. Uh, I want you to repeat what you just said. You said you believe on the leadership of Mazen Namdekan, which is DOS. Is it what you are saying? Oh, 1000 percent. Thank you. 1000 percent. I have zero doubt. Thank you. This Thank man you. is somebody that has been chosen by God to lead the, the Biafran people. He has done everything from the time he 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 escaped from the, the, the lion's den and he came out within a short period of window. The word that he has said has laid the foundation for Biafran freedom. Uh, June, we are going to be having a one million man match is going to be made up of Ambazonian um, and Biafran. Excuse me, <laughs> sir. Uh, this question, yeah. uh, you keep on repeating it. And I know, I know, I know, I know. You know, there's something that you just said. We have a lot of infiltrators today in Among yeah. Us. Yeah. Even though some of them, they are not. Uh, but I will use this opportunity to ask you this question right now. So that you will explain to us. And uh, because as you are speaking to the people of Biafra at the same time, you are speaking to the people of Ambazonia. Because we are one people, we are brothers. This is not because yeah, yeah. Uh, we are searching or looking for our nation. From the root, we are the same people. And nobody can ever separate us. That is why we are looking towards to restore it and come back together to make African great. Because I believe that we, the Amazonians and Biafran, is those people that will make African great. Of course, some people always say that Africa was a great nation. I don't believe that Africa was a great nation before because they keep on controlling us, ruling us, telling us what to do. So how, when was Africa was a great nation? But Mazi, like I said, Mazi is a respect. It also stands as a soul. Um, you know, the reason why I want to ask you this question, I wanted to ask you this question at the end, but now you keep on bringing it up. Uh, that shows that there's something, there's energy there. And we are going to talk about that energy. That is why I'm coming now to ask you that energy. You see, there's some, some of our people, they were saying, they made a broadcast saying that the Amazonians, they are not part of that one million match that's going to happen in June. Some people are propagating the issue, feeding people lies fabricating stories they are saying that Amazonians are not part of us and that is the reason why we try our best to search for you and i think to shuko kikabiyama shuko kikabiyama means the, the 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 god created heaven on earth you know i think to shuko kikabiyama that we have you and you accepted our invitation but now let me tell you so let me ask you something tell us more about this one million march how i mean prepared the abazonian people are and tell us are they coming from every part of the world to come that uh european parliament which is in belgium in brussels to to march to tell the world that we need our freedom so i want you to tell us more i mean tell us a lot of things that we want to hear like i said some yeah. people they are out there Telling some gullible people, telling them that the Abazonia they know, the Abazonias they are working with, are not part of those one million march. That whenever people see Abazonia flag in Belgium, that is not Abazonia. They are Biafran people trying to flash up the Abazonia flag. That is no Abaz I'm telling you what I'm telling you is true. If you I know, want me to, I know. to bring out the Trust video, I'll bring out the video, then you listen to the Trust video, me. you know that I'm not lying. That is the most important thing. So I want you to explain to the great people of Biafra and great people of Abazonia because we are one people. Tell them how to come there. Tell them, I mean, I want you to ginger them, please. Thank yeah. you. The if, floor you, is if, you if you are not being attacked, that means you are not if you are not in a, in an area where you can score a goal. Every time you venture into the 18, and excuse and me, sir, please, yeah. please, uh, I don't want to, uh, please, I just want to put it. Are you working with Sho Ayaba? Are you under Sho Ayaba? Yes, I'm a second deputy. Now continue, yes. now continue. It's okay, continue. That is what I I'm want to know. second deputy, the second in ranks in the ADF. So be sure of that. I'm the top attache to 
to the, the cabinet of the governing council. So I speak with authority. The, 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 the program in Belgium is very important. It's not just a program that you have people protesting on the streets with flat, and after that they go home and they sit quiet. It is not all about that. There have been a lot of work done in the European Union in the corridor of diplomacy to, to make sure that this action will reinforce what our organization, IPOB, and the Ambazonian Governing Council have been doing within our, with, with our partners within the European Union. We have been doing a lot of uh, di demo, uh, diplomacy there, and you have to have the backing of the people. You have to show a show of force uh, for, for our effort. So that is why this is very, very important. You have both Cameroon intelligence services and Nigerian intelligence services that have infiltrated every forum that we discuss, every forums of their friends, be it WhatsApp, be it Facebook, and they are spoilers. They are there to inject venom, to sow confusion and suspicion, so that instead of us focusing on what we can do to mobilize people, people start to become concerned as, who is there, who is not there, who was there, it was not me, it is that, it is that. That is just the work of the enemy. But the work of any true patriot is to realize that it does not matter who holds the flag. As a matter of fact, it does not matter who, who organizes it. This is something good. Righteousness is good. When you see something good and you are a good person, you are a true patriot, you have to support it and ask questions later. But I'm here to assure you because they have asked me the question that this is not just a match. The one million match, the whole, it's right in June, 14 and 15 of June. So it's far. People have time to prepare themselves because it is not. It is also to control the, the narrative diplomatically. It is also to reinforce the push that we have been pushing in a very critical time when the war is talking about the right of sovereignty, the right of, of a people like they see in Ukraine. So this is very important. Our people should take it very importantly. And we should also be very mindful of people who come, who, who come with unsubstantiated claims to, to frighten people, to scare people away from participating in things that are, are beneficial. If you are not involved with the IPOB, if you are not involved with this match, if you are truly for, for, for Biafra or for Ambazonia, there is no way you can be against it. There is absolutely no rationale. The idea that you can pretend that there are some fake Ambazonians or fake Biafrans people there, or I don't like this group, it is not organized by my group, it is organized by A, not B. All those things are signs of people who have been compromised. And trust me, we will be walking along this route with this journey with wolves in sheep clothing till we get to freedom of Biafra and Ambazonia. There will always be people like that. But the whole way that Manzi, Kan Manzi Namde Kanu have built his institution and, and Dr. Choi Yaba is for them to be able to push through lead with leadership without these spoilers and enablers, these this double agents being able to affect or divert their course. So we hope that our people, they should always use their judgment every time initiative come. It does not necessarily mean it must be from one person or the other, but once it is something that is good, you should fall behind it and ask questions later. Uh, thank you, thank you. Let me bring back uh, again your name and your position because uh, it's very, very important that uh, great people of Biafra are listening because I know that uh, the Abazonian people, they don't have this problem because I know that the Abazonian people, they have gotten to that stage that you can never condemn what they are doing. Of course, today we are still having some infiltrators, those moles, those charlatans and inconsequential around us uh, because we are still creating awareness because I know that someday we will get to that level that nobody born of a woman will come out and begin to condemn the leadership which our leader Mazin Namdekanu put in place. That is why we're seeing everything that is going on today but I know that the great people of Biafra have heard it from uh, Capo Daniel, the Deputy Defense Chief of Amazonia. He is a deputy to show Ayaba. You know why I ask him this, that name, if he is on that show Ayaba, that he should, I mean, explain himself more better so that people will understand. Because 
when some of our people, the gullible one, we go out there and begin to listen to some idiots out there, believing that they are telling them the truth. You know, we are having all these conflicts about the Abazonian people. They are not coming. They are not part of us, that they have already spoken to the leadership of Abazonia, and they know that they are not going to work with our Biafran people. They are not going to come there. That is why I'm asking you, are you real, the deputy, and you said it, and I know the people, of, it's like you want to say something. Do you want to say something? Yes. I want to tell you that we also have the same problem. You remember there was one uh, one guy who also call himself the president of Ambazonia, he's saying uh, where wishes to Buhari. Remember, who will do that? And so, you, you, the, if a Nigerian people, Nigerian intelligence service want to have voices from somebody claiming to be Ambazonian speaking for us to confuse your people, they will get somebody to do that. But like I say, our people, for you to be free, you must demonstrate a level of intellectual maturity to be able to separate the chaffs from the wheat. So every time people say things, you have to make the, our people, it boils down to our people. And I hope that the education you do in your program, you have been doing so well. I follow, I follow your media outlet to educate our people. It's for them to always make the right decision and who to believe. It will come down to that. We have also gone through a lot of problems in our, in our struggle as Ambazonia, where you, our people are confused. They don't know who to follow, who to listen, because everybody sounds genuine. But when it comes to action, that is where you know the people who are really for something and who are against. Because those who are, a, who are, who are double agents, you can know them for one, one easy way to know them. There are people who oppose things, who are, which is for good. They just oppose it. There is no, for example, if I am, uh, if I am of, of a different group of Biafra and I don't support IPOB, I'm not IPOB member, and I hear that IPOB, they are marching in Brussels for the sake of freedom of my people and i'm not in that group i will just sit quiet if i'm genuine i will not be there beating my head because if they do it it will not take away anything from me so when you see people who are going out of their way to condemn things that are good there is no way you can say a protest in brussels to the european union is bad then you have to start know that these people who go around criticizing this movement they are just fake people it's like the people who, who are saying that they don't like we should they, there are, there is no there's this guy they have given him access in nigerian press to talk about ambazonia there they are facilitating things for him the buhari government and he represent himself as ambazon as ambazonian leader there are also people who present themselves to us they call us every day to say that they are the real ipob they are the real uh Biafran people but at least we 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 have institutions and we have very smart people that do understand these things and we can make distinction about who is who who is not who and our, we know for, for for sure that our relationship is not just ipob it's the 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 mazinam the kanu and the ipob dr cho ayaba and the governing council they intend to bring the ambazonian people and the biafran people together so that both states and organization can work together so we we always focus on that so that tomorrow, if our leaders are not there, even if our organizations are not there, our people will know that the, the people who were really heroes, who were true selfless leaders, have shown us the light. They are like Jesus. They have shown us the way. This is the way you can do for your freedom. And I believe Mazin Namdekano, I believe in his leadership, I believe in Dr. Cho Lucas Ayaba and their honesty and their commitment to our flag. And they have shown us that...